what's going on everybody this is trailblazer n81 and i wanted to bring you a quick video kind of talking about some of the stuff that was revealed to us today at e3 um now i just got home like 15 20 minutes ago i've watched the call of duty uh trailer i have pulled together a few notes and so this is just gonna be a real quick video i'll have a little more in depth tomorrow after some of the other press conferences i don't have to work the next two days so hopefully i'll have a little bit better videos but i just wanted to bring this stuff to you uh, now first of all the big thing was uh call of duty at the microsoft uh press conference they showed call of duty gameplay and i watched it and i gotta tell you it looks pretty awesome totally different than anything we've kind of really seen before the heads up display is completely different so I'm gonna put a link in the description go check that out uh, I don't want to get in trouble for posting that um, get a copyright strike or anything like that so I'll just post a link in the description now the other thing that Microsoft kind of big thing Microsoft talked about was Halo now we all know that they have teased Halo 5 uh, recently now we're not looking to see Halo 5 Guardians until 2015 but what they did say that they're gonna do is that they're gonna release the Master Chief Collection which will feature Halo Combat Evolved, Halo 2, Halo 3, and Halo 4. Uh, it's gonna have every campaign level plus about a hundred multiplayer levels. Now, for, if you've never played Halo, be a really, really good way to get kind of caught up on the Xbox One. And for those of you who've been around Halo and played, played it all before, good way just to kind of revisit some of your old uh, favorite maps, favorite gameplay in full 1080p resolution. Also, Mass Effect was talked about today. Mass Effect 4. BioWare is currently working on this. Now, they kind of had some conceptual um, reveals today, and, and that's really all it is. They're just kind of talking about this. Uh, from what I've read and heard, this we really shouldn't see this till 2016, but they also tease some new IP that's in development. Uh, they wouldn't really talk a whole lot about it, said they're not ready to do to debut it, um, but it, they made it sound like something that could be very, very groundbreaking. So, kind of, we'll keep an eye on that for Mass Effect 4. Now, in Grand Theft Auto 5, this is something we kind of expected. This is coming to Sony announced that this is coming to PS4 in the fall. An Xbox One version is also being worked on, as well as a PC port. Uh, not quite sure as far as the dates. Uh, when that's going to be released, but we knew this is probably something that's going to happen. Grand Theft Auto V came out right before the new gen, next gen consoles were were released, and so we were all a little disappointed when they weren't on the PS4, weren't on Xbox One. Well, here you're going to be able to get that. Now you will be able to save uh, transfer your save progress from the PS3 or the Xbox 360 to the PS4 to continue your progress. So that's kind of cool. You don't have to start all over. You will be able to um, transfer your progress. Now one of the other games um, that I kind of read about that I've seen uh, some info on looks really cool. It's called The Crew. Now this is an Ubisoft game. It's a, it's an MMO uh, car game that not just like specific maps throughout the United States. This makes it sound like it's going to be a huge uh, map of the United States with online huge uh, lots of people involved in this. Now this is going to be available November 11th on the Xbox One and um, PS4 as well. So if I can find some video, find some more information, I'll bring this to you. But from what I'm reading, this sounds very, very cool. Be able to race across the country with uh, some of your crew and uh, battling other crews along the way. So that's some of the big stuff that was announced today. I'll get a little more information tomorrow. I literally got home, like I said, 20, 25 minutes ago. Just watched uh, the Call of Duty trailer and then wanted to put this video together. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, come back if you want to keep getting some E3 news throughout the rest of the week. Hit the sub subscribe button. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And as always, Bumblebee Tuna.